we're really excited to be here this morning. It's been um, a wonderful day so far. We had Edwardsville CEO students here from Father McGivney, Metro East Lutheran, and Edwardsville High School this morning creating entrepreneurial um, opportunities for uh, the kids here in the community. And we were also, we scheduled to do our ribbon cutting with the chamber for the second time. This is a, a reschedule from uh, one of the snow ice storms that we had earlier uh, this winter and um, we've been in operations now since November 30th here at Trace on the Parkway and we're loving getting settled into our uh, new facility here. We have approximately 8,000 square feet, large private dining space, very cozy, comfortable main dining room and then a much larger bar area compared to our original location. We love being surrounded by all of these other great sh uh, boutiques restaurants, businesses here at Trace, uh, the development overall, we're just super excited to be a part of it. Um, we have so much extra outdoor dining space and we're getting ready to head into spring and summer season where we're going to be having live music every Friday night and Sunday afternoon. Um, we're located right off of the Madison County uh, bike trail and I think that it's going to be a great summer here. Um, uh, not only just the residents that live here, but everybody in our community um, has been very uh, supportive of the move. And we're looking forward to finishing or completing our renovations at uh, the Park Plaza location into what is going to be known as 1818 Offshore, a new seafood restaurant here in Edwardsville. It's been a challenging couple of years I think for a lot of people but what I'm most excited about is to get back to work to get back in the restaurant and doing what I love um, after opening the new chop house and offshore we'll actually finally feel like we're settling in again and getting back to our roots and so I'm super excited about that all right what 